Um, got a question here about best practices or thoughts on Windows Hello for Business via account protection policy in Intune. Any preference for defining those settings under device scope or user scope? Uh, assign the policy to uh, the a user group or a device group. So, <clears throat> great question. I've been diving into Windows Hello for Business a bit more over the last uh, couple of weeks here. Um, and so for this, uh, let me just browse to the settings that we're talking about here. So if we go and create a policy and account protection here, let's just give it a name. And here we have all of our configuration settings. So this is another area that we can configure Windows Hello for Business for our um, users. We have all of our standard Windows Hello for Business um, uh, settings available here, uh, what type of settings we want available, uh, the you know maximum and minimum pin length, um, that sort of thing. As you can see in here, there are a couple of different categories. We have our device scoped settings and we have our user scoped settings. Um, so what I've been seeing uh, uh, broadly is, let me compare this to um, another section here. Uh, where do I want to go? Sorry, I've got some little ones here at the house. I can hear stopping around upstairs. Um, so I want to go to uh, my devices, Windows Enrollment, and Windows Hello for Business. And you'll see these are the default um, uh, settings here. And they're going to be set to uh, all users. Um, <clears throat> and so um, typically, sorry about that, they're distracting upstairs. Um, <clears throat> typically for these, uh, I, I'm going to assign them basically to all users. Um, I don't believe this includes devices as well, even though the name implies it. But let's just double check that real quick. Devices at the time that they enroll. You know, that's a great question. Um, I'm going to have to double check on that, uh, which this is timely. Like I said, I've been working on this. Um, and right now, this is working. Uh, in the testing that I've been doing, this particular setting works just assigned to all users. And it appears that all of these settings are coming down. Uh, but let me do a little bit of testing on uh, what I was working on was comparing the two. Um, Windows Hello for Business through the account protection versus uh, the tenant-wide settings here, um, simply because I want to be able to uh, manage that, have a little bit more control over um, uh, where these settings apply. Um, and so I'm going to take that as some homework to talk about next week. <laughs>